Representatives on Wednesday has called for active measures by the federal government to mitigate the effects of flooding in the country this year. The motion was brought to the floor at plenary by former Speaker Femi Gbadabia Miller on the need for the federal government to proactively put measures in place by giving palliatives to prevent the worst economic or socio-economic consequences for Nigerians in the affected areas. The House also called on the federal government to urgently implement palliative measures to mitigate the effects of fuel subsidy removal. The resignation of Femi Gbadabia Miller as members was also read by the Speaker, Tajdin Abbas. Aware that Nigeria is yet to recover from the 2022 flood, which affected more than 4 million Nigerians, displaced over 2 million people, caused the death of 665 people, damaged about 355,000. 986 houses and destroyed an estimated total of 944,989,000 hectares of farmland. The House is also aware that the experience of the 2022 flood caused the federal government of Nigeria to constitute a presidential committee to develop a comprehensive plan of action for preventing flood disasters in Nigeria.